What's going on, Moon Gang? Let's talk about cryptocurrencies. We'll go over that main stock play, Riot Blockchain, ticker symbol Riot, R-I-O-T, and then we'll go over Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Dogecoin. Uh, we're gonna do a quick technical break breakdown so we're better prepared for whatever's coming up, not only this weekend, but next week. Don't forget, if you wanna be able to buy Bitcoin and Ethereum, check out the BlockFi link below. I just started myself, I've had a great experience. Depending on how much you deposit, you can get up to $250 free of Bitcoin. And then on top of that, if you wanna store it with a, a if you wanna physically store it in a ledger, there's a link for that too. Depending on when you're watching this, the ledger deal, there's a special Valentine's deal. It'll be ending February 15th, so make sure you hop on that. Those are the first two links below. BlockFi for Bitcoin and Ethereum, and then ledger is so you can store it if you're worried about the online hacking. First, let's start off with Riot. Just so you know, to be completely honest with all of you, I am bullish on all of these things. Um, I have two call options on Riot, $55 strike, expiration late February. Uh, as of now, I'm pretty much uh, scratch on it. Uh, that's in terms of Riot. Here I own Dogecoin and Ethereum. Doge, I am up 84%. I'm in at 0 0.038. And then Ethereum, I own, what are we at? I have, I invested at 1,332, so I'm up 39%. Um, just so you know, in my private accounts on BlockFi, I, all, I own even more Ethereum and Bitcoin. I am bullish on the sector as a whole. I love how so many things are coming together. Tesla put it on the books, MasterCard's in its networks. There's talks of Apple allowing it on the wallet app. I think the future is insanely bright for the cryptocurrency world. Just so you know, I'm planning on being a long-term investor on Bitcoin and Ethereum. And for Dogecoin, I'm riding the wave. I am fully a member of the Doge Army, I would love for it to hit $1. I'm not saying that it will, I'm just saying that I would love for it to. On the screen now, you can check out Riot's daily chart. It had a great day because crypto had a great day. Riot was up 14%. Over the week, it's up 110%. And from the start of 2021 until now, it's up 190%. Here's its look. I mean, it's been skyrocketing. Um, I, I wouldn't suggest chasing it now. We had this nice breakout above $29, $30. Um, I think the sky's the limit for it, but from a technical perspective, just to optimize your risk to reward, you might wanna look for the R side to cool off, kind of come back down and see if you can get in to Riot um, at one of these levels of support between 30 and 32. Like I said, I do have those call options, but I would love to invest in the company um, if I can pick it up on a nice discount. Overall though, I am very, very, very bearish on Riot. Let's switch over to Bitcoin. Just hit a new all-time high today of 49,000. If you've been keeping up with these clips, the live streams, you know that I've been calling for Bitcoin to hit 50K. I think it's just like Thanos, inevitable. I think it will happen sooner rather than later. It perfectly ticked 49,000. As I'm filming this, it's at 48,000. Let's see how it plays out over the weekend. One thing I do wanna bring to your attention is that you should, well, first of all, you should never chase anything, whether it's Riot, Bitcoin, any stock I ever talk about, don't chase. Worry about minim or optimizing your risk to reward, and the best way to do that is by minimizing your risk. But from a technical perspective, what I wanted to bring up is clearly Bitcoin has gone up from early January until now. Over the past month, it's gone from 42,000 to 49,000. But with that being said, the RSI hasn't. This is known as bearish divergence when it continues to go up, but the RSI doesn't. And it just means that there's less bullish momentum here than there was here, as in the new high has less bullish momentum than this old high. This is commonly indicative of a future decline or a brief sell-off. So in the short term, I think that Bitcoin will struggle also because we have that key psychological level of 50,000. So what I would imagine happening is that I'll take it uh, hit 50,000 and then maybe come off. There is support at 44,000. There's more support at 42,000. I would love to pick up more Bitcoin in this range and then ride that for the long term. That's what I'm seeing in kind of the medium and short term for Bitcoin. Of course, in the long term, I'm bullish on it. Uh, here's a look at Ethereum. Similar graph, slightly different. Um, I just wanted to point out the current technical structure. It's very much in this wedge. So I will actively be watching not only the current all-time high of 1,855, 1, but this top trend line. What I'm expecting is, because we have that same divergence in the RSI, I'm expecting a rejection 
at some point on this top trend line. Who knows, maybe it'll come at that nice psychological level of 2000 and come down, and that's what I'll personally be looking to buy more. I think it would be amazing to pick up more Ethereum uh, below 15,000. Honestly, I don't know if that opportunity will ever present itself, but if it does, you can bet your bottom dollar that I'll be buying more. And finally, let's talk about the meme stop. Dogecoin, Doge Army, Doge to dollar gets me excited every time I think about it. Um, so recently it's exploded. I just wanna point out how it's been following this trend line. Uh, clearly previous resistance, which has turned into support at 0 0.059. So basically at six cents, watch that. If it breaks below it, things could get more bearish, but things could get very bullish. If not only if it breaks out above this white trend line, but also this resistance just above seven cents. If it can get above it, I feel very, very confident of Dogecoin not only going back up of eight cents, but really testing eight and a half. And once it gets up to a new all time high, I would be then looking at that key psychological level of 10 cents. So once again, overall, I am biased on it because I'm bullish on Riot, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Dogecoin. If you wanna buy Bitcoin and Ethereum, check out the link to BlockFi below. And if you wanna secure all those safely offline, check out the link to Ledger. There will be a promotional deal that's gonna end on February 15th. Overall, if you wanna stay up to date with all the Moon Gang streams and clips like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications.